So this is the code which we have written last time. This time I only want to show you a few more operations that you can do on vectors with the drop map pattern. And we've seen we have overloaded operators so we can do vector math like, just like that. But we have also other options. We have uh, member functions uh, which do the same thing. For example, this one would add vector A to B and return the result. But we've also implemented versions with an underscore and these underscore versions mark that they modify the original vector which they operate on but they do also return the result they can't be used on constant vectors for example normally it's a good thing to mark everything as const so you can't modify them by accident so this time if you would compile this method call would fail but this one would still succeed because it doesn't modify the original vector. The same thing applies also for the scale. The scaled version returns a scaled version of the vector by the factor that we pass in, which would be the scalar. But we do also have the version with the underscore, which would modify the original vector and scale it by the scalar or the factor we pass in as an argument. Another thing I would like to show is the same thing we have for multiplying vectors we do also have for dividing by constant. So if we would um, divide by a constant, let's say 2, that would return um, a with half the length of a. That would be equal to each component separately by 2. 